the storm of gaining be with you. What's up, ladies and gentlemen of YouTube and Grand Star Legion? Stormstriker69 here with another Storm's Singularity video and also another Summertime Splash video as well. The next game I will be doing, obviously, it'll be uh, another Nintendo 3DS game. The game that I will be doing is called. Aquamoto Racing 3D for the Nintendo 3DS. This is one of the Nintendo eShop games. Yeah, there are some of you out there that may own this on your 3DSs, but if there's people out there that don't have it, well, since it's a Nintendo eShop only game for the 3DS, I don't know if, it, if you're able to get it anymore, but for you guys that do have it on your 3DSs, you're lucky. But if there's some out there that never even heard of this game or never got to get it for their 3DS, well, there are other versions of Aquamoto Racing for other systems. I believe there's an Aquamoto Racing game for the PS4 and the Xbox as well. So yeah, I believe there's an Aquamoto racing game for the Switch as well, and the Wii U. Again, if there is a Wii U version of it, um, I'm pretty sure that one was also an eShop game on the Wii U, so I don't know if it's gonna be available on there or not anymore. So yeah, um, anyways, Aquamoto Racing 3D for Storm Singularity, not Singularity, Bowser. Oh man, it's time to get wet with Storm Singularity and a summertime splash. Yeah! That's what Bowser said. It's time to go into the water and water ski on Aqua Motor Racing 3D for Grand Star Legion's video for today. This will be the fifth video for Summertime Splash. So I hope you guys enjoy. If you do, please remember to click the like button, comment below, share with your friends, add the favorites, and click that subscribe button. And also don't forget to click the notification bell to know when we upload new videos. If you, are, if you want to, you can also check out my main channel as well. I upload on there very frequently as well. And yeah, so let's get on with the game, shall we? Aquamoto Racing 3D I gotta turn the music probably all the way down Due to copyrights, you know. All right, let's see what we got in here. We got single player and multiplayer. What's in the multiplayer? Oh, yeah, I forgot to mention this is an eShop game for the 3DS. For you guys that own the game, I'm pretty sure the online on the game still works. They they didn't turn the Wi-Fi off on the 3DS. They just shut off the eShop on the 3DS, which is kind of weird, to be honest. The 3DS is not useful without the eShop, actually. Because uh, 
for anyone that has a 3DS, now you got to now you have no choice but to get your games physical now. But the, the games that are ran for eShop, they don't have physical versions. However, I do remember places like GameStop giving out eShop game codes from GameStop so that you could buy at GameStop and put on your 3DS. But I don't think that works anymore either because it's for the games, the eShop on the 3DS. So yeah, that's that sucks. Um Anyways, let's get on with the game. What does single player have? You got championship, quick race, tutorial, garage, achievements, and statistics. And you can also earn currency as well. And there's a ranking system. Right now it's on beginner. Let's check out Quick Race first. Actually, let's check out the garage first. The Storm ISE 100. Hey, that's a good name for that. <laughs> the Storm 2 GTI 110. The Leviathan SE 120. Yamakaze yeah, GTI 130, Trident STX 150, Speed Devil GTX 220, Dolphin GSX 120, Reptile DX 120, Strider RXT 180, Kraken FX 350, Expert Shark GSX 150, Wave Dancer DX 150, Secret Watercraft. So you got a Secret Watercraft that you can unlock once you get up to Legend rank. That's pretty cool. I wonder what that is. Anyways, we're going to go with Storm 1 SE 100. You can also edit your, your rider and change his color. I'm going with green. All right, let's do a, what does the statistics have in it? Total race time, distance traveled, longest jump, highest jump total career progression and on the top statistics says money earned races won races completed stunts performed and crashes so basically shows you what you've been doing in the game basically it keeps track of how many times you crash and fail, basically, <laughs> or wins and losses. All right, we're gonna we're gonna do quick race, tropical waves on easy. And race settings. There is a mirrored mode for this game, just like uh, Mario Kart Seven. There's also a storm mode. You can also set up laps as well. We're gonna stick with three laps. You got AI difficulties. It goes from easy, medium, hard, and okay, simple. AI opponents can go up to, uh, let's see. One, two, three, four, five. It goes up to five opponents. I'm gonna do one opponent. Because we're just having fun. And we're going to do three laps. On easy difficulty. If you want to play this game on hard difficulty, go right ahead. And you can even add all five AI opponents if you want to. And storm mode. And if you want to, if you haven't unlocked, 
do mirrored mode. I'm pretty sure that'd be as hard as heck. <laughs> But yeah, I'm gonna have it on. I wanna have the storm mode on because I wanna see what that's like. And I'm pretty sure you're. I'm pretty sure you guys are also interested in what that looks like as well. So let's dive in. It's qualified. Or should I say this? Retired. Now I'm going to try a race without the storm. Yeah, with the storm mode on, if you, if you notice, it makes the water go crazy. And let's just say it makes it harder to move, basically. If you see those three red balls there, you got three chances. If you miss a marker, you get disqualified. Start race. I, I went off bounce. I wasn't paying attention. I was just joyriding. There we go. easier when you don't have the storm mode on. I'm 
pretty sure the Storm mode is also on the PS4 and Xbox version as well. Makes the game look really crazy. We're going on a water ski adventure ride. All right, so we did Tropical Waves. Let's check out Stunt Bounty next. No Storm Mode, because we've already seen what Storm Mode does. So yeah. And we're gonna stick with one AI opponent. Because we are basically trying to joyride, but at least with one opponent. Yeah, there are ramps you can jump on there. Yeah. What are you doing, Storm? You're going all over the place. Keep quiet, Bowser. Wait, that wasn't Bowser. That was Patrick Star from SpongeBob. Oh, did somebody say my name? SpongeBob, is that you? Now we're getting the hang of it. Final lap. This game looks fun. You should try it, guys. If you have a PS4 or an Xbox, uh, get Aquamoto uh, Racing and try it for yourself. At least on there, you can still play it. I think there might be a PC version of this game as well. Finished. Yeah, we got it. Although we didn't get the gold, but that's fine. As you can see, there's also a time trial thing as well. If you get good time, it gives you a gold, a silver, or a bronze medal. Or how what your time is on the board basically yeah that's pretty cool next we're gonna do a toll race here we go All right, time to get in focus mode. Money! Did somebody say money? 
The waves are going crazy. I don't know what that was, but that's pretty cool. treasure chests everywhere. If you're lucky enough, you can actually run into them and get money. I've also ran into money bags as well. <laughs> it's a pirate's life for me. It looks like you can do tricks as well, but I haven't figured that out. Yet. When you're in the air, basically. It's like you can do flips and tricks. All right. Indian hair. Indian air, no hand. Another thing. All right, we got a silver in this one, and we also got the high flyer achievement. Yay! There are some places you can also unlock. You get wet paradise, coconut bins, tiki jumps, reef tour, shore splash. Let's see. That's pretty fun. What did y'all think? Y'all want to see more? Okay, so these ones have to be unlocked. Greece has Coastal, coastal Rush, Village Bay, Cliff Crash, Temple Dash, Bridge Jump, Maze Tour, Marine Mania, Rock Surf, and then Egypt has River Run, Nile Action, Flood Flow, Karnak Race, Bank Passage, Desert Cove, Inlet Tour, Final trip. All right, so that's pretty cool. What's in tutorial? Okay, tutorial is basically showing you what you can do. You got the bows, which are the things that we were basically driving around. We have to go to each bow. If we miss a bow, it will disqualify us, basically. And then you got the, the money bags and treasure chests that you can drive over and get. Yellow bow should be passed on the left side, while red bow should be passed on the right side. Passing a, passing a bow on the wrong side counts as a miss. If you get three misses during a race, you are immediately disqualified. And for money, Drive over money bags and treasure chests to pick them up and receive money. 
You can also receive money by winning championships and completing stunts. In the garage, you can spend your money to buy new water crowns. And of course, on the bottom screen, there's the controls. You got accelerate, turbo boost, steer left or right, and then in-game menu. And then you got the turbo by pressing by passing bowels and performing stunts, you gain turbo. When the turbo gauge is filled, activate it to receive a temporary speed boost. And then tokens can be found high up in the air above the ramps. If you jump high enough to reach one, your turbo gauge immediately fills up. So that, that blue thing in the air that we hit was a token. Okay, that's pretty cool. And then, of course, you can perform stunts, drive up a ramp to activate stunt mode. To perform a stunt, tap on one of these stunt icons on the touch screen. We didn't really do that. Of course, we were just joyriding. What's in the championships? Beginner Cup, Novice Cup, Amateur Cup, Expert Cup, Pro-Am Cup, and then Pro Cup. And then in the middle is the great, is the GP. And then there's also a Season 2 as well. Which you have, you have to unlock all of those. And it looks like you have to unlock GP as well. It's great out. Alright, that'll do it for this game of Autumn Aquamoto Racing 3D for the 3DS, Nintendo 3DS. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please remember to click the like button, comment below, share with your friends, add up here to click that subscribe button. And also don't forget to hit the notification bell to know when we upload new videos. And if you want, you can also check out my main channel as well where I upload frequently. You guys enjoyed this game and I will see you guys next time.